the atmosphere as well as. So they did a really good job together out there. Timo Zivistra now for the Netherlands. This is Hexagon's double Dutch. This is an 11 year old, a rider who first sat on a pony age six, moved to horses at 14 and trains at a style Hexagon in the Netherlands. Now there she coaches, she deals as well. And this is a ex young rider's horse that she brings forward. The horse has done about four or five FEI Grand Prix in the past and she had a personal best of 69% in the freestyle. That was at the end of last year. Still a stallion, this horse. Still a covering stallion as well. And we were saying yesterday how fantastic that is because it's not easy, when, especially when they're still covering. Absolutely. So it's brilliant that they're out here still working and doing their job at the same time. Well, yesterday she scored a 67.870 in the Grand Prix. So she'd be looking for a, a high 60s, maybe into the 70s in her freestyle. Absolutely, and I think we discussed yesterday, wasn't it, the Piaf that wasn't the strongest. He's got to get stronger to get that quality a little bit better. So it'd be really interesting today where she places that Piaf in the freestyle. Sometimes the world tries to knock it out of you. Some words in the music. Look at that, modern. Let's see how the judges take that. <laughs> I believe in music, the way that some people believe in fairy tales. Nice bold entry there. Really straight down the centre line. Straight into the massage there. You can just see a little bit she's losing the rhythm, just waiting for him to settle a little bit more. Yep. Into the PF. transition she comes across there. It does have a super extended drop, doesn't it? Does. It? Really su really super line there in the uh, half pass. Make it as steep as possible. Mm -hmm. there she came into the half pass. She did well just to correct it in time just before anything happened yeah. too badly within the half pass. You can see her kind of preparing to come into that pirouette. She just came slightly tense. straight out into those twos. So she's had a mistake there again. So let's hope again she has also a free line. And she'll be thinking as well in her mind, you know, to make sure that she keeps that free line ready for those twos. Extension. Stocking really makes it look expressive when you come across the diagonal of that as the leading leg. Yes, it does. Oh, so now she's had a mistake in the one times as well. So, you know, when she has that free line, what's she going to choose to do? The twos or the ones? Where she's going to be able to fit them both in, I wonder. abrupt transition to yeah. walk there. Let's hope she can get the relaxation a little bit more. Lusik is becoming slightly tense and she's working hard just to try and get him to relax a little bit. Exactly, and the, you know, great technique to add the extended walk on a half circle. Yes, yeah, absolutely.
double pirouette. And there's that line for that. Ah, a mistake again in the twos. Such a shame. You can see the passage half past there, so that's another form of difficulty, especially going straight into the piaf. That was a lovely movement there. Mm. Such a shame about those two times and one times. Yes, it is. Music down the centre line for the final time. So I think you'll be pleased and a little bit disappointed at the same time there. Yeah. You know, yes, it is a shame about the changes. She didn't quite get them enough out there. Um, but at the same time, she did well pulling some marks in, especially from going from the Piaf Pruette into an extended trot at the finish there. So that was a great movement to add in. And also, I love the fact that she did the... Uh, two passage half passes as well. That's yes. incredibly difficult to do. And it fitted lovely to the music. So, you know, there's some great marks out there she would have pulled in, but it's a little bit of shame what happened there in the changes. Mm. Well, that was Thamer Zavistra of the Netherlands with Hexagon's double touch. It's an 11-year-old. Coming into that pirouette as well. And I think she'll be really pleased with his way of going. He was much more relaxed out there today mm. than he was yesterday.